everyone. This is going to be system test 15. For the pole station, we have a notifier NBG12L. That over there is actually a fire alarm sign I made. Uh, let's see. There. I've actually put a running man there, too. Alright. Right there, that red box is my system sensor MDL sync module. Following it up, we have a system sensor spectral alert advance SR remote strobe. 75 candela. There you go. See, I don't even have to be right next to the board. I can still show you all the alarms. Right next to it, we have my system sensor P2R spectral alert advance horn strobe. Set to code 3 medium volume, and it's also set to 75 candela. So my camera will zoom back out there. Alright, so... I'm going to take the camera off the... I also put labels on this. See that? There we go. See with this light, it makes everything look better. But I'll be turning that off so you can see the strobe sink. Yeah, just get my key ready here. Alright, because this is going to be loud. So, in three, two, one. For the first time, everything in sync. Whoa! Oops. I just destroyed my RSS box. <laughs> Turn this thing off. It gets quite warm, actually. See how horrible the lighting is? I don't know why that is. My phone doesn't do that. You probably can't hear it. I'll just let you see that. This is actually quite bright. Oh god, it's so loud. Okay, we're gonna turn that off. Ugh, it's only on medium volume and it's like killing my ears. I thought it wasn't that loud when I originally tested it because I've had it on low volume. And then I was like, well, if low volume isn't that bad, then why don't I just switch it to medium volume? Well, I kind of regret switching it to medium volume. I can't even imagine what it would be like on high volume. It's not that loud of hearing protection, but it's super loud without it. I just took my earring protection off and shredded my ears. No wonder people hate having these installed although they're really convenient to install I mean they are very nice though I, I do like the aesthetics too bad the L series is going to replace them All right. just so you can see everything a little bit better and as you can see maybe my camera wants to focus there we go BG12 says activated. Scroll in on that a little bit. I mean, zoom in, scroll in. I don't know what I'm saying. Uh, okay, so. Which notifier key? Here we go. Could use any of them. There's the model, NBG12L. I forgot to mention that I did get, uh. I got the P2R new inbox. The SR new in box and that pole station new in box. Go ahead and oopsie. There we go. It's kind of hard to do one handed, but there. Now we can to that back. And why don't we test the smoke detector? Uh oh. I'm pushing the test button, but nothing's happening. Why? Why is nothing happening? Well, I'll show you why nothing's happening. And that's why, folks. I disconnected the smoke detector. Uh, this four octagon box is just a acting as a junction box to the pole station. The reason being is because it would take too much wires and work to hook the smoke detector up to this 
sync module, so I just decided to keep it separate. Otherwise, you would have waited another week for a system test. Well, that was a loud system test. We might as well do it one more time. And then the advances are going to be gone. A little bit of an update. I put in new back boxes that are 2 and 1 8 inches deep. Basically, that allows me to um, put older alarms that... So, we are going to do this one more time. So, in 3, 2, 1, push in and pull down. It doesn't have to skip so it can sink. See? It's in sync. The first time. That's probably maxed out that. Let's take a walk, shall we? See, it's all flashing as one bright strobe. And it is actually pretty bright, because those are both 175. And I'll turn this on so you can see the reset of the pulse region. I like the light, but it messes up the strobes the way they come out on camera. Turn that off. Okay, so loud. People didn't lie when they said these things were so loud. I don't know why it does that dear thing at the end, but a lot of people do that. I think it's just the capacitor. Alright. And let's reset. See how much crappier these videos are? Because the lighting is terrible in here. It's actually not really that bad at all. It's just the camera. I don't know. The camera doesn't like low light, and the low light mode totally messes up the videos, so... I don't use it. Hey, you know what? Ugh, the third time, why not? <laughs> Three. Actually, we'll do it this way. Key activate. Not really, but more like flip the switch. All right. I don't know why it does that. I don't know why. It resets itself. Why not? Okay. Power on. We're running at 15 minutes, so I gotta end this thing. So, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in another video. Thanks.